Hey guys, what's up? Miss Brooklyn here. Welcome back to my channel, Miss Brooklyn's Journey. And I'm back with an update on my weight loss journey. Now, this update is long overdue because I have since long ago finished my 30 pounds in 30 day challenge, which I'll talk to you about that in this video a little further on down in the timeline. But before we get into the video, if you are new, don't forget to hit the subscribe button because yeah how you just gonna come upon the video watch the video when you don't hit subscribe what are you doing what are you doing with yourself subscribe right now <laughs> and make sure you have your notification button turned on that way you do not miss my uploads and to all my day one subscribers my longtime subscribers the family the brooklyn knights make sure y'all notification button is turned on so y'all can be a part of notification squad and i see y'all in the comments early but yeah follow me on my social media network links and names are down below in the description box as well as my beauty channel and my vlog channel so the last time we talked i did a official weigh-in i was i was what um 253 or 254 i can't really remember i'm gonna link it down below so you guys could take a look at that, take a gander at that, that I went on to do my 30 pounds in 30 day challenge, which was very, very, very successful because no, I didn't lose 30 pounds in 30 days. However, I lost a hell of a lot of weight and I almost made it to my 200 pound mark drop, um, weighing in at, weighing in at officially 237. So that was the lowest weight I was at that point. Right now I'm back up to I'm back up currently right now because I'm eating a little bit more. Um my caloric intake is a little bit higher and I'm no longer truly low carb. Although I think I'm gonna go back because the success of that was amazing. Amazing. And the reason why I'm no longer low carb in it right now is because I worked out heavy. I burned a minimum. A minimum of 1100 calories in the gym minimum so when I leave physically my body is so drained like I, I literally give all that I have in the gym my body is drained I'm tired so I have to eat I have to eat so um, I'm eating a little bit more um my deficit is a little higher I'm no longer on a 1300 calorie I'm up to an 1800 calorie diet now which is really good because um, it's, it's, I'm gonna say that it's hard because I cannot hit it. It's very hard for me to hit it. So yeah, a little bit more complex carbs help me hit it. Um, am I still intermittent fasting? Yes, that's not gonna stop. I'm actually gonna change, I'm gonna break it and change it because I wanna shake things up in my body. The reason why I stopped the updates on the 30 pounds in 30 days um challenge or stop showing you everything i did in the course of those 30 days in videos because you guys only got two workout videos and i think two what i ate today videos so that was four videos in that series and plus the video the live stream where i explained the entire um challenge and gave the regimen in the description box i'll link it down below in this description box if you're still interested in it and you want to do it on your own time go ahead and follow it um good luck <laughs> um update me in the comments um really because uh, my computer broke both of my computers broke one of them the sh the screen um the hard drive fried um because of the editing program that i was using it was too powerful and it was an older model computer so it fried it and the whole screen fried and frizzled and the second one the hard drive um my hard drive basically crashed and burned and died like i had to get a new hard drive so um, now that I'm back and running, um, which is great, I lost my videos and um, I didn't get to back them up onto my portable, which I now have because I'm not trying to lose anything again. So I lost the videos, my update that I filmed and everything. Everything was just gone. It was lost. Um, I showed Snapchat. Uh, we were on Snapchat and I was showing them like everybody was like, dang, both computers. I'm like, yes, both computers is a dub. That's it. My guy, we laid him down to rest, but I'm back up and running now. Um, with me, how am I feeling? Uh, I'm feeling amazing. I, I have to be honest. I'm looking amazing. I'm feeling amazing. Everything is just like falling into place. Like, I feel damn good. I think the best decision I've ever made was actually signing up for the gym because I go, I, I go into the gym and I'm motivated by everybody I see working out. It feels good. I'm motivated and challenged. You guys may not know this about me, but I'm very competitive. I'm a competitive person. Not in a, oh, I'm a show you manner, but oh, I'm going to get it too. So, um, 
with that being said, I guess, you know, being fat in the gym, it's, um, I talked about this in a video before. Being fat in the gym can be very intimidating, but because by nature I'm competitive, it's like, oh, I'm going to show you. I'm going to be in here killing it. And I do, and I love it. My sweat game is crazy. I go in there and I leave it all on the gym floor, like literally limping out of the gym. But, I mean, it's 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 probably the best decision I've ever made. I feel so accomplished. I've become one of those people where I have to hit the gym. Like if I if I go a few days without being in the gym, mentally I'm there. My mind is um my mind is not feeling good. You guys, my body is coming together. Um, which I'm pretty sure I've, I'll have video footage or pictures throughout this video as I'm talking so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Um, you know, side by side, looking at myself before, where it's before where it's like, oh damn, I lost a lot of weight. No, now it's like, yo, girl, you are not that girl anymore. And it's feeling really good. I'm looking slim and trim. I'm feeling slim and trim. One of the things I never really did was put my hair up. I'm putting hair up now because I feel like my face is a lot smaller and it's like, uh, wait, uh, honey, uh. looking at myself back in the day, like how, how far I've come and it's just like, damn, you are half your size. I still got a ways to go, I'm not gonna lie, my stomach is like, damn, finishing up on this back of mine and my stomach my back and my stomach is like really what's really left like I, I think I, my legs are it's coming together my, my back it is it's work in progress it's coming together that's why I never really do back shots because I hate it but honey the back is whew, girl we about to say what back fat really really soon because we be hitting the machines and um you know just looking at myself and saying I've come so far actually giving myself the credit of I've come so far. There's a lot more work to do, a lot more refining before I even see my goal. And who knows, I might see my goal weight and say, okay, this body still needs work and refining, which that's really what I'm working on. So yeah, next up is my fitness challenge, um, which is something for me personally to just so, you know, my reps are more, my stamina is more, just really building my fitness um, aesthetics. That's really what that is about. Do I, If I lose measurements, more measurements, that's great. And that's another thing I'm going to really focus on is mass and measurements and things of that sort. So, you know, letting you guys know that. <laughs> what else? Oh, I do want to mention I am going to be participating in Vlogmas this year. Not on this channel, but on my vlog channel. So, I'm going to be doing 12 days of Vlogmas throughout the month of December. And it is going to be on B and JTV. With that said, you may see more of my regimen, more of my actual life day to day when it comes to the things that I'm doing on that channel, aside from this channel and just the videos that I put out. Um, I do plan on putting more meal preps out and cooking tutorials out for you guys because you guys are requesting it. I'm really trying to get everything that I, I'm trying to remember everything. Um, I don't know, I'm just. Like, I'm loving it. The process, um, I'm loving what I'm looking like. I'm loving what I'm building. The waist is getting smaller. Oh, here's what I wanted to say. People cannot stop telling me how good I look. I'm getting so many compliments. The compliments from people that are actually seeing me like, yo, girl, you are dropping. It's almost like, what did you think of me before? It makes me feel a certain way. I'm like, thank you. Thank you, but then it's just like, well, damn, what did I look like to you before? You know, so it, it's a um, it's bittersweet, but I'm I'm you know I mean I, I'm loving where I'm coming from. Um, <sighs> a lot of attention from men, a lot more. Like I always got dudes like attention, like always, but it's been you know up a little bit more. I can't say my booty don't have anything to do with it, cause like y'all y'all I'm really building an ass, like it's really coming through, like it's looking crazy when I'm a little less shy about my back fat I'm gonna really really show y'all and when I start thotting on Instagram don't get mad I worked for this you feel me don't don't be mad when I start thotting I'm just joking uh, you know I wish everybody the best of luck in this last few days of 2017 I know this year itself for me has not been um the best year I don't even oh I'm getting emotional talking about it talking about it talking about it talking about it if y'all knew the troubles that I've went through this year alone off when the cameras shut off when these lights are off and um, I'm no longer Miss Brooklyn and it's just 
reality, you know, real time reality. Um, you guys, <laughs> y'all be like, how the hell do you even come on here and smile? I'm telling you, this year has been the most tried year of my life, year of my life, the most tried year of my life. Like, I'm not even gonna lie, I've never been so tried in my life and tested. This year has been the year that has almost broken me down. Like, but, you know... I have faith and um, I may be weak for a moment but God picks me up and say let's go and I and you know I rely heavily on God heavily 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 and I think that's one of the things is when you're becoming so much more spiritual the devil really say nah you want to continue living life how I taught you to like I mean oh my gosh I'm not even not even gonna get into it because when I tell you like this year almost took me out almost took me out but you know um i'm here i'm determined i'm a fighter i'm ambitious like i'm very stubborn i'm a leo like you're not nah i'm not going down that easily and um <laughs> shit has been tough but um one of the things that i commend myself on is not giving up on anything that I'm doing. Not my journey, not my life, not my business, not like anything. It's just not not giving up and continuing to fight. I might be weak for a moment and be down for a moment, but I get my ass up. So, you know, that's something that's just like... But yeah, you know, with that being said, I really pr pray these last few days of this year, you guys, I pray a breakthrough happen for every single one of you. I really, really do. I love you all. I will see you all in my next video. Please do me a favor. Like this video. Please. Like, if y'all don't do nothing else, just hit the like. Share this video. Um, You know, wherever you feel like sharing it. Follow me on my social media networks. I love you. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.